Are you feeling tough? Because today we're gonna build muscle and get that heart pumping with a cardio and strength training boot camp workout inspired by the women football players on the new show, Pretty Strong, on the Oxygen Network. Let's do this. All right, I'm so excited for this boot camp workout. We have Madie and Grace to go through the workout with us. We're gonna start with a very athletic performance based warm up, okay? So with the A skip, you're just gonna pop that knee and toe off the ground. You can always modify if you need to by doing a high knee march, okay? But if you can get that heart rate up a little bit more, that's always good. Get that coordination with the arms, so you're really pumping those arms as well. Our training boot camp workout today is gonna be very performance based, so you gotta get that quick agility warm up in, right? Good job, ladies, bring it on. You guys ready to switch it up? We're gonna go into a set of butt kicks. So with this, you wanna make sure that you're kicking your heels up to the glutes. You're pumping your arms a little bit. Good, those ladies aren't letting their arms drop. They're keeping them nice and tense, getting those shoulders warmed up. All right, you're going with the heel. So you're really firing up the hamstrings and the heart rate, right? Yeah. I know, it's like, whew, I got you right here. Good, keep going. If you can hit that booty with that heel, then you're really firing those muscles. And we want those back of the legs to look nice and strong, right? It's hamstrings. Good, three, two, and one. All right, now we're gonna get the inner thighs with the gate swing to warm up the quads. Start with your feet together, open up, sit it into a nice deep squat, jump it together, and right back out, okay? So this is very agility-based warm up. With this one, you could always stay in the, in the squat position and just go into the nice little squat and open those knees up, get that nice stretch in and out. Breathe. <laughs> you can already hear me getting breathless. It's good. Step over here. That's right. Keep it going. A couple more. Good. We're gonna go into a straight leg raise next. All right, so standing up nice and tall, you're gonna plant one foot step back with the other, then you're gonna give yourself a nice straight leg kick. So here, try to keep your legs straight. Ah, think about your toe pointing up towards the sky and your heel pointing away from your body. Really extending that hamstring, that calf, and you're firing up those front of the thigh and those hip flexor muscles. You guys doing good? Yes, yeah. I love this one. <laughs> good, abs are tight, right? Core, engage it. One more. Kick it up and switch. Plant that other foot and go. So right, if you're on. This is a really good chair. stretch too. I know, it's great. And you know, you can do an isometric stretch when you're you know, getting done with the workout, but here you wanna do more of a um, performance-based movement where it's dynamic. You're getting that movement and that stretch in the muscle. It's activating it. It's not getting it ready for a cool down. It's getting ready to work, right? Bring it one more. Awesome, okay, now we're gonna go into a nice little lateral lunge so we get the inner thigh, take a big step out wide, sit the hips back, get that good stretch, come together and go the other side. Now here, make sure your knee is in line with your toe and you're facing forward. Get that nice stretch. You don't have to go super low, you might feel that stretch up high. If you really wanna get deep, you can go down even lower, feel that stretch and come up. You know, everyone's got different flexibility, this is not really to work you that hard, it's really to get that opening through the middle. And it feels so good. Oh yeah, switch it up. One more on each side. Get that nice extension, open up that groin. Other side, good. Breathe, awesome. Okay, now we're gonna go into a runner's lunge push up. So take a big step back, hands to the inside of that foot. Start warming up by pulsing. All right, you're dropping your elbows. You're dropping closer to the floor, feeling a nice extension through the hip flexors. Oh yeah. All right, that's what these pretty strong women are doing on those football warm-ups, right? Uh, yeah, they now are. you're gonna step up together through that deep lunge and go to the other side. All right, good, open it up. You can do this stretch anytime you're out for a run, doing any kind of cardio, but if you get this stretch in before a sport activity, really good to warm up those hips and get that big opening stretch through the legs. Beautiful, last two, one, and relax. Ooh, so okay, everybody better feel the blood flowing right now, right? Absolutely. All right, we're gonna start in a push-up position. We're gonna walk across our mat, warming up our shoulders, and go into a little burpee. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna come across your mat. If you're at home, just walk laterally, 
Couple distances, you're gonna jump in or walk in. You're gonna go up for three jump squats. One, two. On the third one, come right back down, jump out, and you're gonna walk to the other side of your mat. Now don't let your hands and feet get too far apart here. Keep it slow, jump in, jump up for three jump squats. So our burpee's a little extended, it's a little advanced. Jump back out, all right? So this is more like sports performance stuff. This is a boot camp. You guys are now getting ready. Take you to the next level. Build that muscle, build that strength. How are you ladies doing? Excellent. Good. You're enjoying yourselves, right? That's yeah. right. Jump it in. You got me breathing hard. <laughs> Good, get those three. You can always do that. Modified, nice, Marty. Get way to show them that modification. Back to the other side. Good. Let's get it in. For three, two, one. one. Oh, nice Ooh. job. All right, total body move right there. Now, going into a reverse lunge with a hop. So this is a kind of a deep lunge. Marty's gonna show you modification. We're gonna come back, we're gonna touch. Big, strong leg stance right here. Like we're ready to just take a sprinting leap forward. We're gonna come up, switch our feet, come right back down. Come up, switch feet. Notice how I'm giving it that little gallop? I'm getting off this front leg here. Pushing up through my heel, pushing up through that front leg, and I'm switching. Takes a little coordination, your abs are gonna feel it. You're getting a deep stretch, so really working your butt. In and out, go. Up. Good, come on, two more. Boom. The more I get into it, the higher I can get on my jump. Good, and <laughs> relax. All right, now, bring it down. Another big combo move we're gonna do is a push-up, spider crunch, shoulder tap. Here's what it looks like, ladies. Let's show them. You're gonna go down for a push-up. Come up. Spider crunch is hand to foot or knee to elbow. Both sides. Then hand to shoulder, hand to shoulder tap. Back down for push up. Exhale up. Spider crunch. In. Try not to rotate your body too much. Shoulder, shoulder. Push up. So I'm giving you a break from the push up. Then I'm requiring you to use a lot of core, a lot of balance. A lot of stability. Can modify your push-up like Marie. Good job, sister. Good. Thank you. Looking good. I'm breathing. Down. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Up. Spider. Spider. Shoulder tap. Shoulder tap. Awesome. Woo. All right, take a little breather. Now, if you have a free weight, great. If you don't, that's okay too. You can grab a free weight if you've got it. We're gonna do a little rainbow weight. So in a V-sit position here, Good, you can pick your feet off the ground or let them hang out on the ground, okay? Whatever's comfortable for you. Have that weight. Oh, I got a 10 pounder here. I'm gonna do a rainbow over my body to the other side. And I'm gonna hold myself in this V-sit. Oh my god, oh, yeah. they oh, yeah. fire. My arms and my shoulders are working. A lot of stuff going on Everything's here. Everything's working. That's right. <laughs> Somebody tries to knock you over in a football game, you gotta have a strong core. You gotta be stable. So this is a move that will help you do that. And it'll give you a nice, tight, lean abs, too. Breathe. Good. You guys are awesome. <laughs> Come on. Don't give up. If your arms are working, great. You're going to have nice, strong biceps and shoulders. Chest is strong. Exhale, cross. Let's go one more side. Yeah. Good. And relax. Oh, yeah. All right. Up on your feet. Okay. Now, this one's my favorite. Three-point stance. You're right here. You're low. All right, if you're up here, it's modification for your knees. You're low, you're gonna go. Quick feet, come up. Good, moving fast. Three point, other hand goes down. Up first, quick feet. Good, down. Switch arms each time. Up for quick feet. I feel like I'm ready to play. That's right, three points in, go. Up for quick feet. Get ready, get ready, hit it. Up for quick feet. Now you're on the balls of your feet. You're not flat footed here. Hit it. Up on it, come on. Hit it. Up on it. Good, hit it. And relax. All right, good little taste of it. Now let's go back down into our push-up walks. So we're gonna go back into those burpees. All right, so your heart rate is up, you're still working. You guys are looking awesome. Let's start walking it again. Back and forth. Each time we get to the end, jumping in or walking in. Give me three squat jumps. 
Work those leg power right back down. Abs are tight on that walk. Do not let your hips sink to the floor, okay? Keep it strong. Get to the moon if you can. Get aggressive with that jump. Especially if you like being sporty. Good. Back and forth. Jump it in. Good. Soft landing. Soft. Soft. Back out. Good. Walk it across. Oh, my heart rate is up. Mine is too. I'm loving this. Let's go in. Let's go two. And back down. Oh, I love it. Okay, you guys. Nice work. So reverse lunge with a hop. Back and forth. Remember, you go as low as you feel comfortable. Right? Up and switch. Up and switch. Push off the ball that foot. Push off the heel. And get that good explosive jump at the end. It's like a heel to toe move here. You end up going off the ball of your foot, but you land, make sure that heel is flat. Back and forth, come on. My quads are on fire, my booty Breaking down. is on fire. <laughs> two more. One, go up, two, and relax. Woo, yeah. Okay, I know our legs need a little break, so we're coming back down for push-ups. <laughs> so we're back down here. All right, push-up, spider, shoulder tap. Let's rock and roll. Go down, push up. Keep a steady, a steady body on that spider. You saw me lose my balance a little bit. As your abs get, get a little bit more tired, you're gonna wanna let your hips rock. Try not to. Try to keep it steady. Breathe. You guys are looking great. Thank you. Nice, keep the exhales going. One more time. Push up, ah, oh. in, shoulder tap, shoulder tap, ah. Oh. Oh. That's right, yeah, yes. get hungry. Right. <laughs> Let's go, back into that nice little seated weighted rainbow. Okay, have that weight in your hand. Let's go, up and over. Remember to breathe. That's right, abs are tight. Feel that pull on the opposite side, yes! Good, now if you don't have a weight, guess what you're doing? Touching, here, touch. Really reach out, really reach out. Because now you have no weight, right? So now you really gotta let it go. With a weight, it's harder to go that far. Ah, good, breathe. I'm smiling through the pain. That's right, yeah! Let's Hi, two pain. more. Grace, how you doing? Great. Yes. <laughs> and relax. Okay. Three point stance with our quick feet. Let's go. Last one before a little active recovery. Are you ready? So ready. Yes. Okay, ready. Come on, down. Hit it and quick feet. Come on. Come on. I want a big pitter patter, so I'm off the mat. Hit it. Stay low, stay low. Hit it. Quick feet. Hit it. Yeah, quick feet. Come on. You guys look good. Hit it. Quick feet. Good, hit it. Quick feet. On the balls of your feet, two more. Hit it. Woo. Quick feet. Hit it. And relax. Ah, oh, good job, you guys. Okay, come on down to the floor. Little quick recovery. Now, active recovery. We're gonna activate the abs and open up the hamstrings. So I'm gonna have you do a roll back, get some momentum, abs are tight, reach it forward, open up the legs. Reach, hold, and roll it right back. Nice little roll on the spine. Keep your abs engaged on the roll up. Reach and stretch. Good, so this is more of a functional, dynamic stretch. I wanna give you towards the end, let the heart rate come down, but to still feel like a nice opening up through the body and a nice, Core activation at the end. Breathing it out. And one more. In, forward, reach, hold it. Good, now you're gonna put those legs out straight. You're gonna come down, reach, roll up. Reach towards those toes now with straight legs. And roll down. Beautiful. Come on abs, yeah. squeeze, peel, reach. Nice stretch. Heel it down, one more. You feel your heart rate coming down a little bit, but you're still working your whole body. In, 
Now bend those knees, put your hands behind your, your um, shoulders. You're gonna open up your chest. You're gonna work your butt a little bit here. Think about your shoulders. If you can't do this move, I understand, because it is hard when your shoulders are tight, but you gotta practice. Even if you're up this high, I know it's uncomfortable, but it's really important to start working on that shoulder mobility and that flexibility in the front of the shoulders. Good, come on down and give yourself a big round of applause. Yay. You kick butt, you're tough, good job. Awesome, yeah, you guys yeah, are yeah. tough. Ow. You guys are so tough.